What's up guys, Sinistalker here for a new video. This video up here, since this is the Christmas holiday season, I'm gonna like to show you what I do in the last handful of years. I like to watch during this time of year of cheer and goodness and spooky Christmas goodness and other traditional Christmas goodness, stuff you grew up with, things like that, and things that are just fun and just cool because it's like that time of year. Oh, oh yes, yeah. so let's get down to it now and show you over here and then over there. Boop, right over there. What I like to watch during this time of year. Let's go do it right now. Oh, 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 yeah. And let's go to this section right up here. And of course, I'll probably begin with this classic. Probably one of the oldest tapes in my collection too. And that is Chris Miss Evil, the sought after clamshell VHS of this. And it really cool me with this guy who's at a toy shop. He gets all psycho, things just make him mad. He just tries to spread cheer but people will do him wrong. So he goes after the bad people in a sense and has a really cool twist ending that belongs with the bad guy and that van. Another cool thing, the guy, the, the guy that plays Santa, the, kill, the main character, the killer in this movie, his, his daughter is Fiona, singer Fiona Apple. How crazy is that? That her dad played a crazy killer Santa. But was, was he crazy? Is he good? I don't know. And now he dropped in. Good one up here. And definitely check this one out. Definitely a great one to watch every year for sure. You know what? I'm gonna open this up real quick. And that classic look with the Christmas evil and that silvery, shiny uh, sticker. And it says right there too, Elite Video. Very, very cool. Definitely a great one to watch for this time of year. Then make my way down through some of the VHS. Of course, I got Blu-ray, DVD too, and some 4K I'm gonna talk about also, but let's go with the traditional VHS. Stuff I grew up with as a kid and fun stuff. And I did not grow up with this movie as a kid, but it's definitely a sought after one and a great one that I've been watching every year since I got this for like a couple of bucks. Sought after tape goes for like, I don't know, 40 bucks to 100 bucks probably. Who knows? Maybe even more. But great one. Dan Haggerty in Elves. Also have the soundtrack here from Terrorvision. I got this last year. I think this came out right after Christmas, right before Christmas. It was something like that. I think it was right before Christmas, actually. It had to be. And I got this on cassettes. You know, it's cool. Also on vinyl, but I want to get in cassette form because it's kind of you know, traditionally neat. But this one right here, get back to this. They're not working for Santa anymore. No, they aren't. These are bad, bad elves. Actually, one elf in particular. And he is from like World War II, neo-Nazi, mad scientist. Uh, this woman summons up this elf that just tries to take over the world and, and like the perfect human form. It's really very strange. And Dan Haggerty is up, uh, you know, has bad luck, but... He smokes about 100 cigarettes in this movie on camera, and it's up to him to save the world pretty much from terrorizing elves um, from Santa or something like that. Very trippy, very cool, low-budget goodness from AIP. And I got this out of Video Shop, Super Best Video 6, years back. Um, I said for like a couple of bucks. And definitely happy to have this one. One of my favorites in my collection for sure. And yeah, good, good stuff right there. Good cheese. Uh, hopefully this will get a Blu-ray release uh, sometime soon, but yeah, good, good, good stuff. Next to that, we have Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. We wish you a turtle Christmas. I got this, I believe, for 50 cents or a dollar at a thrift shop. And it was a thrift shop. I got this at probably a dollar, I think, years back. And it's a great sought after one, too, because it's so cringe and weird. These are the strange turtles. Right before the turtles kind of died off, early 90s, this was one of the last things they did was this. And they had these weird faces. I think this is after Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles 3. That really horrible one, and yeah, it's 94, and this is when they took a break for a while before making a big time resurgence years later. But this is good stuff. We wish you a total Christmas. Um, up the sewer, gotta get a gift, gotta get a gift, and the best one on here is Rap Rap. Um, look, look that up on YouTube, and you'd be like, oh my god, how did I go without listening to this every every Christmas? It's it's so good and so bad, but yeah, we wish you a total Christmas. Good good stuff. Love it. I pop this on every year since I had it. Oh yeah. Next to that, had them paired up there for a reason because they're both cool and Raz a strange kids one. Here comes Santa Claus for 1995 shows you four and there's a sticker right there. I guess from a video shop years back over in Riverside area, I believe, for like 50 cents. And so happy I takes this a very strange tale about this these kids and they go in the North Pole, but they take, take like a wrong plan. They end up in the North Pole. That's Santa Claus bringing their parents back because their parents are like lost or something. And it's just very, very strange. I believe it's French. And some really cool songs in it. 
strange ogre that tries to eat the kids and Santa's up to the rescue to rescue them. It's very weird, very bizarre, very cool, very heartfelt. It has all those things in there that you want in a New World Home video. I believe it's New World, yep, New World Home video. And yeah, it's an award winner too, check that out. Oh, oh yes it is. This one is great because it's just the night they saved Christmas. This was always on TV back in the day, 80s, remember like late 80s and then early 90s and it kind of is off TV now. Sometimes they'll show it here and there on weird channels, but great one. Jacqueline Smith, Art Carney, and Paul Williams. Art Carney plays Santa. He was also in the Twilight Zone famous episode, Night of the Meek. He plays a Santa, like a down and out guy on his luck, but he plays Santa again in this thing. Very good stuff. Good, like, you know, good movie. Um, just all around good, good fun about this uh, family. They're like, they're, they're in the, like the North Pole region. They're, they're, their dad's like works for this oil company. And they're trying to drill, but they're doing so. The more drilling they do, the more bombing they do, it can destroy Santa Claus. Stop the Santa Claus to stop them from doing it before they kill Santa and all the men. This is some good, good fun, good cheese, good goodness, heartfelt fun. I said I love this one. This one's great. And moving over here to the 4K and Blu-ray area, you know, and DVDs of course too. We got the course this classic, and that is Nutcracker, the motion picture. This one's a great one. We're always watching this on TV back when, and I get this on Blu-ray. Great production of the Nutcracker. I always loved the Nutcracker since I was a kid. I would go with my uh, grandparents. They would always take me there here in the theater here in San Diego every Christmas time to watch Nutcracker. Great ballet classic. Can't go wrong with Nutcracker. The 80s one, so good. There's also one with Macaulay Culkin. That's pretty good, too. This is the ultimate good one is that. And, of course, you're going to have some It's a Wonderful Life. I have a few of these from Paramount Pictures. This is the 4K steelbook I got last year. Uh, it's from them to review. Love this steelbook. It's beautiful. And a beautiful movie. Just all-time classic in every way. So good. I remember watching this, of course, with my grandparents, my mom, them, everyone. And just a great movie. Always gets you so good. So classic. And I'll be popping that on. Usually the week of uh, Christmas. So I'll be coming up real soon. I'll be popping that on. And right up here, we got the Claymation Christmas, which I do have that on tape. It is right up here. Here's my original VHS when I was a kid with Rudolph, Rudolph's Reindeer, and all that with some commercials on there too. Definitely one of my favorite tastes, but here is the DVD version of it, which you can just watch that on here. It makes it no easy and that kind of thing. But this one's a great one. I remember getting this out. I worked at Sam Goody's back here, Horton Plaza in San Diego, in the movie department. They had this there. I was like, oh my God, I gotta get that. And had it ever since for over a decade now. Very good stuff. There's a couple other ones on here, but the best one on here is, of course, is the Claymation Christmas Celebration. Fantastic, great music, great memories. Definitely check this out if you haven't. It is so good. Santa Claus the Movie, fantastic movie, very underrated movie. Probably, to me, the best depiction of Santa Claus ever on film is with him right up here. Just a fantastic movie, great portrayal of him by David Huddleston. And you got John Lithgow in this thing. And it's just a great movie. Come here, check out the beginnings, origins of Santa into the present day in the 80s. And it's also a McDonald's commercial in the sense at, at times too. But it's just fantastic. Great one. Great music. Awesome scenery. Good effects. Great story. Fantastic. I mean, just definitely watch it. It's, it's so good. It's so classic. St. Claus movie is a must. And it's like 80s gen. I took the skeleton's hat. Chucky still has the hat. I took your hat. I'm sorry, alien skeleton. Don't pro me but anyway up to here of course you have the sonic daily night collection up here i know the 4k came out i believe today of these ones up here but i have on dvd so i must not gonna i'm not gonna upgrade unless it's like really cheap but i get these these are these are satisfying enough but anyway we got silent night deadly night billy traumatized events happened to him as a kid he went to a nun's school for adoption whatever and he just things trigger him and he cracks up at a working at a toy store he's out killing people during the night of Christmas Eve into Christmas. So good, classic 80s goodness. That, this one and Christmas Evil are must to watch um, up to Christmas Eve. They're, they are perfect. They're just like kind of a cozy horror movie goodness. And you saw this, next to these, you got the Jack Frost ones. These came out last year on Blu-ray. And you got Jack Frost, classic good cheese, 90s, um, of a killer snowman, you know, a seal killer, and he went in this Weird solution, he goes to the snow and he becomes a killer snowman. It's this great cheese. And there's part two, which is pretty bad. Uh, part one's definitely better than part two, but still fun, pretty cool, you know, slip case, but man, it's pretty, this one's, ooh, this one's pretty rough. And behind that, you get some Bill Goldberg, former WCW champion of the 90s in Santa Slay. This one is fantastic too. All the great beginning of, of this movie. And just, you know, ultimate horror cheese, Santa Slay, 
Got to wash that the week of too. It's so, so good. And making way over here by the Christmas tree and the little lights and things like that. I showed these before in a video, some of the things I have up here, but these are all great too. Of course, National Lampoon's Christmas Vacation. Here's a still look at that here on Blu-ray. There's a 4K of that, but this is cool for now. And of course, you know, Home Alone, Home Alone 2, Jing All the Way, uh, Scrooge, George C. Scott, and Milk on 34th Street, the remake. But the original one's classic, and of course, here's another It's Wonderful Life. But all those are just so, so good. Uh, put my little elf right there, my, my little elf on the shelf kind of thing. But yeah, this is, all these are great classics for sure. You gotta have those and so much more too. Also some honorable mentions I wanna show here on Tubi, some really cool hidden gems I'll show you here on Tubi that I think, you know, in case you guys have Tubi, which you guys should have, if you don't have it, I'll suggest some stuff on there right now. Off of this one, that is Scrooge's Rock and Roll Christmas. Weird ones I'm gonna show right now here on Tubi that I discovered, in case you guys don't know about it. These are very cool, it's very strange. And that is this, Scrooge's Rock and Roll Christmas, um, VHS quality here on Tubi. Um, it has like these, it's very, it's like it's made like an 84, very weird. I saw this like randomly on here and like last year on Tubi after Christmas, like, oh my God. So I'm gonna watch this, you know, for sure this year. I watched it already, but I'm watching it again this upcoming week, Christmas week. But yeah, definitely checks out Scrooge's Rock and Roll Christmas. It's just you have a bunch of bands from back in the day in this thing. And it's just, it's just very much out there. It's like, you know, like a three dog night, you know, but it's just, it's so cheese cool. This girl, she goes in this shop and Scrooge is like, he's like, you get any records and stuff? He's like, what's a record? So it's, it's very weird. Like, it's like she went back in time to see Scrooge, but it makes no sense and tries to make him feel good through music. It's very odd. But you have cool scenic views like this. So I definitely say, I recommend this one. It's very weird. The awesomeness of Tubi. Then another one to check out, also from like 84, Santa's magic toy bag. I like these like weird like Muppet looking things. And it's like live action, but it's very, very cool. And just definitely check it out. It's very like, it's almost like something was made for VHS. We see I probably came Kmart back when as a stock and stuff for like 299, they would have this. I've never seen it before. Like it looked familiar, but I know I never really seen it until I seen this other day. I saw this like last week on here. I was like, what is this weird thing? I was like, oh, it's so cool. I love like weird stuff like this. And I was like, you know, these like live action puppets, like imitation like Muppet things. Very cool, very cute, very fun, very nostalgic, very retro. Santa's Magic Toy Bag. I kind of forgot the title, but Santa's Magic Toy Bag, check it out. And of course, you're gonna have the He-Man and She-Ra Christmas special, also 80s, 85, dude, check it out. It is so weird, almost an hour long, 46 minutes long special episode of them. He-Man, Skeletor, Christmas, Yule Time Fun. It is fantastically good, like that. Dude, check it out, it's so good. There, there is so much stuff, like in this oddity weird shows, like this, like what's that, I don't know. But pretty cool, definitely check out Tubi. I'll not be disappointed in them. Very cool, gotta love Tubi, it's like the best like, free movie app out there. It, it is so good, there's so much weird, cool stuff. Christmas stuff, weird things, of course horror movies on there, on there and things like that. There's also this one, one more thing. They just put on Christmas Evil on here too. One up there I mentioned, dude, check it out here, Christmas Evil. It was made in 1980, I thought it was 83, 1980. That's crazy. But yeah, definitely check us out. We highly recommend Christmas Evil. So good. And just a quick little rundown of some stuff I enjoy watching that I will watch. I've been watching and will watch up until Christmas, and probably a little bit after that, but right up until Christmas, I'll be watching a lot of good stuff up there. That's it, right there in the shelf. Of course, Santa Claus movie, like all the stuff I was going through, the claymation special. Scrooge's Rock and Roll Christmas. Oh yeah, but there's some nice suggestions for you guys that I like to watch. Some new things for you to maybe check out and things of that nature. So if you guys liked this video, and I hope you guys did, give a thumbs up, leave a comment below. If you're new to my channel, make sure to subscribe. And in the comments below, let me know some of the ones you're gonna be watching for this holiday Christmas season. Of course, you got the staples of like, you know, like I said, Rudolph, uh, Jack Frost, Fries the Snowman. There's so many, there's so many of them. There's, there's tons of Christmas stuff. Uh, this is a few of the ones I put up and like the show. But let me know down below of what you like to watch. Maybe some ones that I brought up here in this video that you guys never thought of and are new to you. Let me know too. And I'll catch you guys later in the next one. I'll see you then. And look out for some more holiday goodness out there. And uh, enjoy watching fun, holiday fun. Catch you later in the next one. I'll see you then. Bye.